Hello, hello, here is BB Walker. Welcome to my channel again. In today's video, I will show you how to fix the common problem with this Philips Latigo series coffee machine. It could be also Psycho coffee machine and similar models. The problem then, the fix that we will do today is to replace this part, which is nothing more than a hot water valve. So if you are interested in how to fix problem with your coffee machine just stay tuned and we will start very soon all right so if you notice that your espresso machine is making less coffee than usual it may indicate that the, there is a problem with the hot water valve and this is very easy to fix and i will show you how to do this without calling a service okay so first i will show you how to check if this problem really occurs and how to indicate first of all of course disconnect the coffee machine from the power source then remove the water tank as in as you do in usual and then open this cage to look inside i hope it's seen there is another video where i'm showing how to do this so let's go a little bit closer here all right so we are pressing this push and brew unit it goes away and then we need to look inside when this part is and what you should look as you can see now my coffee machine is after replacement so there is nothing war nothing to worry there is actually dry area but if you look and see here a condensed water i mean the water drops all around it may indicate that there is a problem with sealing with this part it's difficult to measure it from here oh my goodness Okay, so if you look inside and you will notice a lot of moisture here, a condensed water, drops of water, it means that this seal does not work properly and we need to replace it. As you can see, oh my goodness, uh, something with this light. So as you can see, there's only two screws to remove this part and my part has been already replaced because I have faced this problem. So I will show you how to do this in general basically you need a torx key to do this the size is 10 i hope it's seen this is this kind of screw torx key and you remove those two screws in here very easy and after you replace it of course you need to buy another one but this part is not very expensive it costs only about 10 to 20 to 12 dollars depending where do you live? So basically, as you can see, the usual problem is, of course, I will give you the part number when you can buy it. The problem is with this O-ring here. In my case, I don't need to buy a complete new one part, but some people claims and shows that sometimes this part is completely broken. So. I have ordered the whole new part because um, it is easy and much easier to replace. It's not very expensive, so I decided to, you know, replace the whole part. As you can see, those O-rings are okay. Problem with focus. But the only thing that you need to do is to replace this part with the new one. And the coffee machine will be working as always. So after replacing and screwing those two screws, you just... Put the brew machine, brew unit again into, of course, uh, this part is responsible for providing hot water in here like this. So, of course, if there is bad sealing in here, you will get a lot of steam going around this uh, place, which means less coffee uh, because a lot of steam will go out in here. So it's very easy to replace you don't need special tools only this torx key and this part the links will be in the description i hope you like this video thanks for watching it was bb walker see you later